Hello everyone, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Houses. Once again, this game was donated by my friend Card, and when somebody donates a game to me, I try to follow through with their requests to the best of my ability. And uh, Card wanted to come along for the Holy Temple, so not only is Mist here like usual, <laughs> but also, Card is here. I have, re I have returned. Mainly because, who oh boy, if anyone's reached the gold, the um, uh, blue lines route by this point, they know what's going to happen at this holy tomb. Yeah. Well, everyone who's gotten to this point knows what, what goes on in this holy tomb, but, but if you haven't, well, I'm not exactly going to spoil it. Right. I, uh, I have a feeling that I know what's going to come. Um, cause we, I know that chapter 12 is the, the time skip. So this is the, the big point, basically, you know. This is chapter 11, so we're right on the edge of that big time skip. This is where they would have to reveal the Flame Emperor and things like that, so. I hear the yep. Accompany us to the Holy Tomb. Anyway, but uh, for those who, who, for some reason, are just clicking on, click on this for, for, for the first time, uh, last, last month, um, so, like, uh, Serene over here merged with, merged with Selfis. So, now she's super minty god flavored. <laughs> oh, yes. And, uh, if you haven't caught my previous episodes where I've been griping and complaining about her green hair that I absolutely despise, because green is the worst color in all the world. <laughs> um, Ouch. Yeah. I mean, that is personal mm. opinion. <laughs> you know, those of you who like green, go ahead, like it. I won't tell you no, but uh, I hate green. Like, I have a burning hatred for the color green, honestly. So... Who is Rhea, really? <coughs> the kitty. Boop, the kitty. Boop, the kitty. Oh, well, that, well, that question about who ah, cause, is Rhea. Cos, Cos, Cos. please, Blake, no Cos. I'm so nervous. I'm not ready for this. I got to interrupt my cat. I'm sorry. Things like that. <laughs> but he put his paw on my finger and then his claws <laughs> came out. <laughs> you have something on your mind. Mm. Who, me? Never good. No. It is oh, it didn't uh, actually hurt me. My I had my finger You're in the right. very center of his I paw. No so what. his claws couldn't curl enough to touch I'm my sure. finger. So you know. Right. Yep, but still. It's just that bit of oh boy. <laughs> Lost in thought? Hmm? Oh, I suppose you could say that. Nothing to worry about. Ah, dang it, now that one song from Fire Emblem Faith is, 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 is stuck in my head. <coughs> Lost. <coughs> yeah, I started off on the wrong note there. <laughs> hmm. Are you surprised, hmm. Professor? This oh. is this place. Where are we Just for? wait a moment. Has been hiding beneath the monastery all this time. That could be even more familiar here in a second. That descends beneath the ground. This is where the goddess who created this world. But in addition, to rest, along with her children. Kitty. <laughs> It is said that oh, by the way, at the time of the, at this episode's recording, Byleth just got released into Smash, so yay for Byleth. Yep. yep. I was actually watching, um, I was only, I only watched like half an hour of it, but Nico posted, um, the, uh, his, him playing Smash with Byleth. I do. So long. <laughs> I have waited so hmm. very long. But yeah, as someone who actually has Smash and has played with Byleth, I'll say this much. It's probably not probably, probably not the character archetype I like playing as, but you know, hey. Good to, good to, good to have them in here. Right. Well, 
It was supposed to be but a step away. Anything? Anything at all? Safe. Hmm. Nothing? Yeah, well. <laughs> Reveal yourself! <laughs> Don't move, any of you. If you move, there you is. Hey, Mitt, how you doing? Thank you so much for guiding us this far. The Imperial Army. Yep. The Flame, em the the flame Emperor themselves. <laughs> Why is the Imperial Army here? This can't be. How did they get into Garrick Mock? Even the Flame Emperor is here. <laughs> Can only mean oh, I will say this much right now. Like, the th like the air, the atmosphere in this fight is definitely different on the Golden Deer run, mainly because, uh, well, Claude isn't as unhinged uh, as Dimitri is at this point. <laughs> because if you've been re recalling, Dimitri has been kind of losing a, a grasp on, on his sanity. Yeah. You'll trample anything that stands in your way. Just like you Ever since Remire, he's been like that, like, like he's been that. very close to to, to snapping. Yeah, hopefully, 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 whoever the uh, flame emperor is doesn't doesn't cause him to snap him, snap completely. And he says, knowing exactly what's gonna happen. <laughs> she laughs, knowing exactly what's going to happen. creator. <laughs> Okay. Time for Flame Emperor. Mm-hmm. You know, whenever it finishes. Blake, that the is fight. a paintbrush. Yeah. Alright. Let's look at our map here. Ooh. It's very green. Yep. If you ever notice that the green seems to be a recurring co color motif for the for the for the Church of Saros. Yeah, it seems to be. Along very, with white. It, for some for some odd reason, despite being green being a terrible color, it seems to be a divine color in this game. What with uh, friggin' Seth and Flame and Rhea and me and Sothis. Okay, turning off my computer mouse because Blake has decided it is a good thing to attack it in my hand. <laughs> Rip. All right. uh, yeah, because normal. Right. Well, well, green is a motif for uh, at least for Hello Cat. Hello, Jace. Hello, recording? Yep. Sorry. And... It's okay. It's okay. I can only take nine people, but I can adjunct three, so I really have to think about who I want in this battle. <laughs> the only one that's required. And I'm probably just gonna want all my top tier units. <laughs> probably a good idea. Bane, Bernie, Dadu, Mercy. And already got two riders, so let's use Lysithia. Um, actually, it would probably not be a bad idea to take out Dudu and add Dorothea for her dance. <coughs> Alright, let's see where our units are actually placed now that I've got that set up. Um... Uh, Dimitri, you, you seem to be suffering. There we go. <laughs> he seemed to have been suffering from a case of um, invisibility there for a moment. <laughs> that was uh, that was quite funny, actually. And here I thought my uh, mods on Breath of the Wild took forever to load. I mean, what? I don't, totally don't have my Wii U hacked and. Tons and tons <laughs> of mods on my Breath of the Wild game. Nope. Not at all. <laughs> no. Come back. Um, alright. I'm gonna do a quick save. This seems like a big fight, so I wanna make sure that I'm really ready. I will not allow such violence from the Empire. 
Strike down the rebels and protect the holy tomb. Ah, Frank! The are in the caskets. Open every last one of them. The holy tomb must not be desecrated. Protect as many of the crest stones as you can. Take the crest stones. If they're stolen. Uh -oh. You can get them back by defeating the foes who have that have My them. ghosting. Can earn from no. based on the number of crest stones. You've I hear you, card. I might be ghosting. Oh dear. I don't he think can't he can. hear us. Yeah, I was gonna say I don't think I think he I think we can hear him, but he can't hear us. He uh he has hmm. that issue, unfortunately. For those not familiar. Blake has just sent my mouse <laughs> mouse just oh. falling to the floor. Rip. Um. If I send these this guy up here, they are gonna aggro. Alright, let's kill the mage real fast. Oh, sorry about that everyone. I kind of ghosted for a moment. Yeah. Well, we heard you the entire time. Yeah. We could hear you, but you couldn't hear us, so. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's it's why I said that I briefly ghosted where you know like uh, I could interact where I could interact with anyone else, but you know I could but you know I couldn't hear anyone interacting with me. Right. Get you over there. Ready. <sighs> okay. Yeah, that'll be fine, I guess. Oh no. Oh, Blake. What am I to do with you? That I. 71% chance to hit and a hit. Nice. That's always <laughs> useful. Uh, Felix, and come up here. That's again. Oh boy. <laughs> oh dear. Leave it to me. Uh, for those wondering, I'm having a bit of co a connectivity issue, so. Here we go. <laughs> Mercy here. That's my cue. Um. Could do a dance for Bernie. Then she could attack again. That's sure what it is exactly that keeps causing me to just stay focused. Lose my connection, but I do. So sorry about that. If I if I seem to just be bouncing between actively commentating, just being it just. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Rambling. It's fine, card. Yeah, we understand. I'm sure they understand. Get wrecked. That is that. All right, that should do it. And Sylvain's just got these two guys going at him. Blake, you don't need to scratch my monitor. Didn't seem to pull any aggro away from that to crit. What's next? I mean, if nothing else, you know, you'll always be able to. Oh, I didn't see that those were over there. That is enough. Know what those stones are. It's enemy swipe crest stone. Okay, I, I totally missed that those guys were there. We have the stolen crest stone has started to retreat. Hello, big mobs. Well, at least they all have to go through me to actually escape, so. Blake. Mm. You're sitting square in front of the middle of my monitor. I, kind I can't of see shit. Out. No, I didn't want to do that. I, I can't even see what you did. Oh, I had to meet. I had Dimitri go over to this one guy and I was gonna throw a javelin at him and then it auto-targeted the beast instead. And so I completely oh. missed, Ta ended up attacking the monster <laughs> instead of the guy. I just divine pulsed. Oh yay, actual items that go into my inventory. That's always fun. Um. I can't get to him with Sylvain at all. Silly Blake. 
Uh, I guess I can't get to him with anybody, really. Uh, not Sylvain Felix, I mean. Why does my computer mouse drive you so crazy, Blake? Because sometimes cats be crazy. <laughs> yeah, because cats. Here we go. That's the reason why. Because cats go nuts over the weirdest th things. You want me to come over here? Don't attack the PlayStation controller! And we need disturbance on the demonic beast. And now put me next to this guy. Mm -hmm. And I can hopefully get to him. Um. I don't suppose I can do anything here, can I? Not really, no. Blake, do not make my prescription oh, disappear. And that is all three bottles on the floor. <laughs> That's my cue. Go ahead and dance for... Bernie over here. I need that. Blake, I Bernie stay next around. My headphone cord. <laughs> Don't scratch at the monitor. It's time. Yes. Yeah. I see cat picture. All right, well, that did that. The main thing I wanted to do was come over here and kill this guy before he goes after Mercy. Am I done yet? <laughs> yeah. I've got there Felix go. there. And Felix doesn't have a battalion, right? No, he doesn't. He has the sword of Zoltan! Which sounds way more impressive than it looks. <laughs> um, okay. The only person that hasn't gone yet is Ingrid. What do I want Ingrid to do? Um... Really? Ingrid doesn't have any battalions? What the heck did I... How did I, how did I not give her a battalion? Maybe you just forgot to get a flying battalion recharged for her? That might be... It might be that I didn't have a flying battalion that was her level in authority. Because... With battalions being so heavily based on authority, it's possible they just didn't have one at the right authority level. That makes sense. Because, you know, I didn't know authority was any kind of important stat at first, so I just wasn't leveling it. And to find out, it's actually a very important stat. You really do <laughs> want to level it. A lot, and I had no idea of this. Oh my god, so many crest stones! Stop picking up crest stones and just freaking die! <laughs> um, I guess I can do this. Hey guys, stop scratching at my monitor. Stop! And Gambit. Yay! B rank faith! I'm not sure why I got B rank faith from a battalion, but I won't complain, I guess. Um, Ingrid, go ahead and take that shield down. That's a crit. Still alive by a whole two points. 
So I won't complain. Because it is kind of nice that it survived. I was a little concerned that I wasn't going to get the umbral steel from it. Um, kind of just assumed that it was... When I saw the crit, I just kind of assumed that she was going to auto-kill it and that would be it. I think it's a like wicked two-handed sword, though. Yeah. Quite the sword. Rip! This is what I do. <sighs> Ah, uh, that's the life city yeah, I I know very well. The like <laughs> the like the like the magic crit monster. Right. Um Does Mercy have a battalion? Yes, Sarah say Ow, oh, white magic, so that's not even gonna help. Okay. Um and what about you? You have disturbance. So that can be used here. I can gambit to disturbance. Go Bernie! <laughs> <coughs> and I just attracted the demonic beast's attention, but that was kind of expected. Um, I guess that's yeah, you can always it. Um, I think if I have her come down here, she can get... No? She can't get that corner. I was like, you could always have Sylv... Huh? Uh, oh, Sylvain still, is still active. You could get, get him to get, do la to get that last of a corner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yes. We are absolutely right on that. I did... I completely missed that he was active. Thank you for seeing that. No problem. Got him! Monic Beast armor is broken. Alright, um, now come back over this way so we can block those guys. Um, Mercy... I don't know if I want her to just attack or... If I want her to heal Sylvain. And I'm using a javelin against this guy at close range because I'm an idiot. Go ahead and come up here to block this guy. Um, I guess if I step here, I can Leaven Sword this guy. All roses have thorns. <coughs> well, how oh, you level up? Yay! And then if I step up here, I can Nosferatu this guy. Crit! Alright. Your beasties are down, Flame Emperor. That's just your worthless little units here. They're trying to steal crest stones. Why did that guy run up to me, but not attack? I don't know. That's very confusing. He literally ran up to me. He should have had the range to attack. And yet he just... He just did stopped. it. I don't understand that. Um... You know what? Thunder. Well, you're dead. I got two crest stones from that one because that guy had two of them. And let's not use my javelin, please. And Lance. Who's next? Yeah, Dimitri level up 27. And got one crest stone, got another crest stone. <laughs> Alright, come down here now. There's still, like, two guys left, but they're all the way up here, so I'm not too worried about them at the moment. The thing I've got to worry about is getting to the Flame Emperor here. Because clearly, he is in a pretty blocked-off state. 
Um, Mercy, come up here and heal Sylvain. <laughs> and then Sylvain can go in. I'm on it. Sylvain can come over here, pull some aggro. Um, they are archers, so he's not going to be able to counter. Oh, good. If he moves at all, he aggroes them anyway, so might as well. Um, mm -hmm. actually, before I do that, I want to make sure I have other units that can get close. So let's just put them into aggro range here, where other units can actually get up to them to help them out. Seems smart to me. I'll put yep. Felix here. That way he doesn't aggro. Lysithia can come up here around this corner. Um, I can come over here and heal. Yeah, I can come over here and heal Bernie. Yeah, thanks so much. And then, uh, it's just archers over here too. Of course it is. All right, so definitely don't put take Ingrid over in that direction and aggro anything then. But I will nope. take Bernie in. I will take Ingrid over here, just not into aggro range. Here they come from behind. Come on, Sylvain, you can take like you like uh, like you've taken you've taken work shots from that. Hey, nice right. dodge there, buddy. Oh, so it happens to be you know, halfway decent with it with magic, so he's also a decent a decent mage tank. Yeah. Nice to see Go kill this guy. But for now, um, I sit here my, like my like my burn this guy to the ground. Thank you. Indeed. Lots of crest stones. Hey, at least I'm getting them back. That's what matters. Mm -hmm. They're not yep. getting away with them. Get that guy. Be gone. I love when the enemy is an archer, but the enemy does not have close counter. So I don't have to worry about them attacking me back. <laughs> mm -hmm. Felix, get in there. Get, get rid of this guy with your freaking gigantic sword here. Why is it always a gigantic <laughs> sword, though? <laughs> Because uh -huh. gigantic swords are cool. Gigantic swords are cool. Yeah, that it, that really is the logic. Is gigantic sword is cool? Why else? Why wouldn't you want a gigantic sword? Because gigantic sword is heavy and would slow you down like a lot. Actually, it would actually be not beneficial in combat. Just saying. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I mean. I mean, I mean, sure. Historically, there, there were, there were some, some ones that. Ooh, yeah. Nope. That don't put. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> I was keeping a close eye on that one. All right. There's still some guys up there, but they do have to come down to me to get to the escape section anyway. So eventually, those guys will come down here. Ha! <laughs> no damage. And here, and here I thought. No and here damage. I thought to do. And here I thought the deal was supposed to be the the blue lion's tank. Right? <laughs> Freaking my Dimitri just being like, ha! I don't take damage. Alright. Yes, Blake. Back Felix, into my lap. This guy. Two. See, that's the problem with being a mage. You squishy. Crit. You don't have a lot of armor to protect yourself from, you know, lances and, you know, swords just slicing you in half. Scythia, come over this way. Mercy, come up here and heal Felix. Um... Serene, can you get to this guy? Yes, you can. Go ahead and kill him. I'll bring you back down for the Flame can Emperor. It's not a big deal. Blake, you are being Great a ridiculous cat. God dang. 
guy had three crest stones. Alright. Step right into the center of that big group there and slaughter them both. I must stay if only. Just wait right there. Get in close. So he can't attack you back. Get that crit. I aim for greatness. Your support is appreciated. Stay right there. Um if I curved shot this guy, yes, I can kill him without getting attacked back. Get wrecked! Yay, level five bandits. And Dorothea. I guess you can kill this guy. And that'll save all the crest stones. Mm -hmm. Go up, Boron. Long, like, long range lightning magic of just screw you. Right. Enemy phase. Let's see, you have a couple of, it's, you have a couple of white mages. Like, like, the, like, the flame emperor themselves. Like, and that, like, and that, like, and that one, like, and that one dude nobody, like, nobody really cares about because they, because they only show up in this chapter and they die. <laughs> I was gonna say, there's this random guy here that I definitely have not seen before. He's a named unit, but I'm going, I don't recognize this guy. So, he, yeah, I, if, if he comes in and he just dies here, then that makes perfect sense. Yep, he, like, he is what we, what we like to call, what we in the RPG business like to call, like, the named, like, the, na the random named Stooge, because trust me, like, you might have a name, you might have a few better stats, but you go, but you're pretty much go, but you're pretty much just a, but by any other name, you're a stooge, you're a mook. Yeah, pretty much. Where are these people going? They're like, diverging left and right doing weird things here. Ugh. Okay, Flame Emperor doesn't look like he's gonna aggro to anything immediately, so let's kill the mages. I wanna get Byleth up, but I also wanna get Dimitri up. Want both of them to get up here for the Flame Emperor before I go attacking. Go up here, heal. Ah! Eight experience uh, away from leveling. <laughs> Hate it when that happens. Uh, oh, jeez, he's fast. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can, or you can just you know, battalion him into 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 non-existence. Yeah, I think I'll just tempest lance. I'm told it's fine to kill those who resist. Now then, how shall I? <laughs> And you can tell he's just a stitch because his name isn't easy to pronounce. <laughs> Metode? No. Right. I was just following orders. I just. Oh. You're, you're just right. following orders. You're just following orders? Well, that's too bad. You see, we were just doing the same thing. Right. That guy <laughs> didn't even get a chance to do anything. He was like. Oh, I'm gonna run over here because they're free for me to attack. And then Dimitri just walks up and is like, I don't know who you are, so die. And he died. Like, <laughs> just like I don't know who what you was are. the what was the point of him? Yeah. I was supposed I was supposed to be per like we can we can your units because and provide a bit of a challenge because like because like because I have a sword that can that inflicts venom. <laughs> right. That but, really but no. was it too. <laughs> But no, no, I is dead. Blech. Ow. You're out of luck. Just go ahead and wait right there. All right. Well, there's only one person left. Mm-hmm. And that is our dear old flame emperor here that we've been dealing with ever since they were introduced at the beginning of the game. Although, if I think about it, they really haven't done much aside from, you know, be like, we're like we're allied with this, with with these people and you know, kidnap flame that one time. You remember right. that they kidnapped flame that flame that one time? Yeah. 
And even then, it wasn't even so much that they were... Like, that the Flame Emperor was a part of that. It was just... It was those who slither in the darkness that did that. It wasn't even really... Like, it was the Flame Emperor, but it wasn't, you know? Oh, yeah, by the way... Helped. Oh, yeah, by the way, aside from a, um, a probably a brief, a brief mention, like, of them, uh, don't expect, uh, like, after, uh, like, after a certain point in this route, uh, don't expect that to ever hear from them again. Yeah. <clears throat> I know that they're, like, the main focus of the gold deer route, so... Well, they, like, well, they provide the, they provide a, at least one, uh, like, of the final bosses. <sighs> Boss right. Rush still have you salty card? Yes! I, I, and I am never not going to be salty. <laughs> you know just how many people died in Dusker? Three freaking times, like, the, like, the Golden Deer route could have ended. But, uh, but at the same time, it makes sense that, like, that we need to resolve every single plot point that, that well, the, the other, the other routes sort of left dangling because they were a lot more focused on the, the characters. Oh, my uh, battery is low on my controller. Oh no! Ooh, I mean, I literally have the cord right here, so I just have to plug it oh, in. Okay. There we go. <laughs> All right, and Byleth. We've seen uh, the dialogue between Dimitri. Now it's time for me. I did not wish to make an enemy of. No hesitation. Oh, oh, insult to injury. Hey, I leveled up. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, I definitely need a level up at this point. I'm a freaking 31. Mm. <clears throat> oh, and three, two, one. Dimitri! <laughs> you do okay, everybody? You look a little bit crazed. Oh, hey, Elgard, what's up? Right. <laughs> ah, symbolic. I've been looking for you. I will take that head from your shoulders and hang it from the gates of Endor! Uh, guys, remember, we, remember how it's been mentioned oh. that... Oh, and, and of course, freaking RNG. <laughs> right. Oh, you have how a ninety-seven percent chance to hit there, Dimitri. Come on. Well, at least you got those guys. But yeah, um, Dimitri just crossed that, that guy's skull with his bare hands. Remember how you you okay there, puppy? Received rusted bow, which I assume is actually probably really good. Uh, can be for oh no, just a silver bow. Okay. I assumed it was something much better than just a random silver bell. Stage complete. Conflict in the Holy Tomb. But yeah, MVP if, Dimitri. <laughs> but yeah, if you've noticed, uh, just like during a lot of his um, uh, supports, it's mentioned that that Dimitri is like crazy strong. Yeah. 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 Um, that was that. That was uh, that in action. And someone actually calculated exactly how much str how how strong it e e Dimitri is because of the force that we, we need to, to crush a human skull, and it's like ridiculously strong. I don't Answer my question. And I mean, like, um, like, like, you know, like thousands of pounds of 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 force of a. <laughs> Like strong. Why did you cause such a tragedy? <laughs> you killed your own the uh, the boar in him is really coming out right now, though. <laughs> behind your actions, have you? I already told you. Well, he. To do with well, it. like I said, this is the like this is the, this is where he finally um uh, snaps. Right. Your Majesty, now you are a monster. Oh, hey, oh, and of course, you were like, yeah, I'm, I'm just teleporting out. Like, no, I, you're not getting, you're not getting that, you're not getting that easy. 
until you have been captured and punished. You have defiled the holy tomb, dishonored the goddess, and humiliated your brethren. That crime will never be erased. Even if you burn in the eternal flames and spill all of your blood into the goddess's soil. Oh, oh goodness, Raya. Let us return. Yeah, this is also when uh, Raya's mask also starts to slip. Yeah. I won't say it. <laughs> I mean, you okay? Card, you and I we both know her. about her, so. Yep. I will kill Edelgard. It only makes sense that <clears throat> Let's return to the would react in such a way. Clear what must oh, be done. trust me, you want to see her really snap? <laughs> uh, find find the crimson flower route. Then you'll see her go. go. Then you'll see her pull it, essentially pull it, Dimitri. So, right. <laughs> Let's see. That's the one where Byleth sides with Edelgard. Yes. Yep. Yep. These two love spilling blood. Uh, yes. I sure can it? certainly imagine. An explanation. I knew he'd be mm, the burden uh, of the tragedy. Uh, what is I it? understand his thirst for revenge. His family and closest <laughs> friends all massacred right in front of him. But it still doesn't add up. There must be more that we don't know. That's true. Dimitri didn't come unhinged until after the Flame Emperor was unmasked. <laughs> you don't think there's some connection? Well, you sound happy as you're humming. Oh, yeah. The leaders of the church have I think like I said, I'm, I'm like, I'm looking up uh, something that's a bit... Rule the world. They have and that, like, then there's her speech. Long ago, they divided mm -hmm. the empire to create a kingdom. And then divided that kingdom to create an alliance. They did all of this to make the masses bicker amongst themselves. They caused instability in order to reinforce their own authority. They gathered so yeah, and um, an congratulations, power. congratulations, uh, it's war. On the devotion of yep. people who wished for the goddess's salvation. Those corrupt hypocrites cannot lead Bodlin to true peace. Their foul mm, but, belief system uh... must be torn asunder. So that true wisdom may finally prevail. <sighs> and so, I have decided, by order of the Adrestian Emperor, Edelgard von Hresburg, the Empire hereby declares war on the Church of Seros. I cannot believe it. Let us recount the situation as it stands, Professor. After you returned from the Holy Tomb, the Adrestian Empire declared war upon the Church of Seros, as well as our allies. Declared war? Edelgard demanded her own father relinquish the throne, and then assumed the position of Emperor. She has deemed the Church of Seros to be an evil of this world, and is calling upon the people of Vodland to help her tear it down. We must discuss our response to this declaration with the Archbishop, after the Knights return from their investigation. Until then, watch over the students. See that they remain calm. I know one who's not gonna remain calm. No. <laughs> <laughs> war on the Church of Seros. We knew this day would come sooner or later. What's going to happen? Uh, don't worry. We can't afford to be optimistic. It's entirely possible the kingdom will be invaded. Settle yourself, Ingrid. We need to carefully consider our options. We can't just act rashly. That will only make things worse. Once we've ascertained the situation, we must return to Ferdiad. Your Highness. <laughs> Dimitri. Who is completely beside himself right now. He's a poor <laughs> child. Yep, and uh, I would me. hug him. But he'd probably crush me. One. Yeah, he White probably class. would. To war. To war. To war. Oh boy. Together, the people of Fodlin relish the beauty <coughs> of the brilliant moon overhead as another year ends. So, yeah. Yeah, we. So, yeah, here you go. The left. The left bit of. Oh. Oh, like, of peace before, well, 
against the sky. Probably all hell. Yep, and all hell breaks loose. Some inescapable truth. Yep. This is the last chapter of part two, part one. <sighs> I'm actually really curious how this part goes down during the... Whoa, okay, straight into the middle of the freaking month here. Yep. We've got two weeks. Yep. Unforgivable. I cannot fathom that the Adrenaline <coughs> Empire would embark on such a violent course of action. Why is not happy? I failed to see the witness. Oh, no, she's not. Part. What is her objective? There is no question on that front. She clearly well, wishes to conquer. Well, you all find out folk. in Golden Deer. <laughs> In order to achieve her own selfish ambitions. Oh, it's, uh, trust me. Uh, like, there's, like, there's, a, like, there's a certain chapter that, that I have the perfect joke for. <laughs> Perhaps she is planning to make herself a false deity by demonizing the Tresseros. <laughs> Adrestia received its very name through a divine oracle. To injure the goddess is a sin most foul that shall not be forgiven nor forgotten. We must stop the Empire, and quickly. I have returned, Rhea. Welcome back, Shamir. Were you able to discern the Empire's movements? Their main troops are marching towards Garrick Mach. How it good. that they will join forces with Edelgard's army and arrive within two weeks. Two weeks? That is not enough time. It will require all of our efforts just to prepare our defenses before then. We must send notice to all surrounding huh. villages at once. We must order the residents of Garrick Mach to flee for their lives. It will be done. <sighs> Professor, listen closely. If our enemy invades the monastery, I will have no choice but to stand upon the battlefield. If something happens to me, I am entrusting my sacred duties to you. <sighs> Why me? You must have guessed it by now. The truth of who well, because, you are. Well, because let's face it, if this, at this point you're like you. I guess Lady, if something happens to Lady Ray, you are the only thing that's going to be holding this place together. I right. I all these long years as a mere proxy for you, but the duty is yours, and yours alone. Only you can lead the people of Fogland. Hmm. <laughs> Rhea, please. You must tell me all that you know, I beg of you. <sighs> that one is the progenitor god. Am I correct? In a sense. Our dear professor is a vessel. One who carries the power of the progenitor god within. But uh, In yeah, time, congratulations, you've got like you just got promotion from like from, from professor to general. To <laughs> I see. I trust that you are aware of the questionable nature of this experiment. But I suppose there is no turning back. I ask that you help our friend. And in doing so, help her. I am waiting. And <sighs> I don't know about General. It feels more like I just got promoted to God. <laughs> well, I understand. Well, As yeah, ever, I will take there's also home. that. <laughs> Flame, were you eavesdropping? Regardless, <laughs> I am glad to hear. It. Although, Card, you we must commend after all. <clears throat> these three's the acting's end? abilities, shouldn't we? Yep. For keeping up their acts even in private. As yep. Yep. God, it is <laughs> up to us to see our mission through. Eh, it must be hard, especially when you find out that you know, like one of the people you've been, you know, like that's been that's been your student right under you, you, you know, has been has been plotting to essentially kill, like kill, like kill you, and, like 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 like, 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 like and over and overthrow the the government for like for who knows how long. Right. <laughs> oh, I have supports now. Oh, just yep. rank supports. It looks like yeah, Felix with Dorothea. Ingrid with Bernie, 
And Bernie that's a C rank, actually. Yeah. No, no, Bernie with Ingrid. How did I not? Oh, I saw, did see that one, Dorothea. Okay, so it's just it's Felix and Ingrid that are the two supports I've got, basically. All right. Well, <laughs> we'll check those out in the next episode. Um, which, uh, if things go the way I assume they're going to, there may only be like three episodes before we finish part 12 here. Um, I mean, there might be four, just because there's probably going to be two battles here on the 28th. <laughs> um, so one explorer and then three battles. There might be four episodes, but we'll have to see what happens. Um, until, until then, um, don't mind me, guys. I'll be like, I need to, I have some, some land in the Alliance territory I need to take care of because... <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Right. But in case, but in case you, you're in the Alliance territory, uh, shoot me a line. Shoot me a line. <laughs> Yep, but uh, well, with that, um, ooh, it looks like I have some certifications I can maybe do. Oh, only 64%. Um, I suppose I might try those, but we'll see. Anyway, I do hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, feel free to subscribe. Check the video description down below for a link to the playlist. That way you can get caught up on any episodes that you might have missed. And with that... We will see you guys next time. Have a good day, everyone. Ciao. See you later. <laughs>